Wow. <laughs> you look gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. It's my great pleasure to introduce you to, for the very first time, Mr. and Mrs. J5. <laughs> To my love, where do I begin? I remember the first time I saw you as I was walking in late to our first day of class. I will never forget our first conversation and how after we talked, I just knew you were someone special. Now here we are, a little over two years later, with many more years to come. Jonathan Klein, you are my favorite person and my greatest gift. Every single day with you, I am reminded of God's love for me. You are gracious, merciful, self-sacrificial, and generous. You are the most caring person I know, and it's because of your heart for Christ. You remind me every day of what we were created to do, to honor and to glorify Him. I could not be more thankful that I get to call you my husband, best friend, lifelong teammate. I love you for the way you lift me up and point me back to the cross. It's not always easy to love others and to die to myself, but you're always there to gently remind me that we are to live this way because Christ loved us and died for us. I promise to always seek Christ first and love you out of my overflow of love for Him. As I read Ephesians 5, I'm reminded of the gift of marriage and how our aim in our marriage is to bring more glory to Him than to ourselves. Just as you lead me and are head over our house, so Christ is the head of the church. I promise to submit to you as you follow and submit to Christ. I love you so much, Jonathan Klein, and can't wait to live on mission with you every single day for the rest of our lives. so good. You look so beautiful. I love that. Now for the first time in my long established ministry, I get to re-pronounce you Mr. and Mrs. J. and Madison Klein. Madison Bradley Klein, from the day I first met you, I fell in love with your heart. Your heart that is kind, joyful, patient, humble, and full of Christ. I am truly humbled to have you as my wife, and I am honored to be your husband. I promise to always strive to live out Ephesians 5 and love you as Christ loves the church. I promise I will always strive to serve you and sacrifice for you. Thank you for strengthening my walk with the Lord and keeping me accountable. I could not have asked the Lord for a better teammate in this life. My prayer is that the Lord will continue to be glorified through our marriage for the rest of our lives. I love you, and I can't wait to see your beautiful self. So marry me in your mother's maiden white In your father's eyes so blue as the southern sky And when I die, when I'm dead and gone
remind me my resting place And hearts like these, oh in love like this The stars line in the sky you sense The love of mine, oh stay the night As long as the light